Welcome to my channel. My name is Salentia, and I'm a mom who's trying to get her family to financial freedom. I work two part-time jobs, but today, you guys, I wanted to go ahead and reallocate my funds um, that I've been saving into their designated binders. First up, we're going to start with my boys. Uh, my boys binder. Let's see. They um, they need some spending money. <laughs> I've been hang hanging on to this um, because I've been like tr just trying to get it up there so I can do a, a, a separate cash stuffing. But um, for my boys, I have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. All right, so we have 60 bucks going into my boys um, binder and I'm super stoked about this. Um, I don't have a plan. I mean, I guess never, I never do right. <laughs> We're not expecting plans over here. So we did spend back to school. Now this should just say technically school because they had a book fair and they spent their money um, that they had saved and then they needed a few more dollars. So I went ahead and grabbed it from back to school. But uh, what I'm going to do is go ahead for now, put five bucks in there and hopefully I can get that you know, really chunky for when they actually go back to school because you know how, how that goes. All right, and then for the birthday, we're just going to put $10, 5, 10. Hmm, I wonder if I should put more than that. Okay, we'll just start with that. We have 5, 10, 15, 20. All right, and then clothes. Um, like I've mentioned before, they don't really need anything. I am going to skip it for now. I do want to start stuffing it though. Uh, for fun, we are going to put, hmm, let's see, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Let's put 30 bucks into fun. Oh, I wonder if we need to should put more. Hmm, what can we do? <laughs> I know they have a, a list of things that they want to do, but, um, and fun is not like a savings. It's just, you know, so we can have money. We're, I'm supposed to be making sure that there's money in here weekly. Um, so we can do something fun. Um, holidays, what holiday is coming up? So we don't do anything for Memorial Day. They don't really need anything for, um, so Juneteenth. 4th of July. Okay. Sorry, I was thinking aloud, but I think since we have a little bit of money left over, let's go ahead and put, um, hmm, let's go ahead and put 10 more dollars into their birthday. Their birthday's in, in June. What is today? April. Okay. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put 10 more dollars into their birthday. So we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, $30 for their birthday so far. And both of their birthdays are in the same month. So I've got to make sure I have a nice chunk for that. And then this last $5, I'm trying to decide, should I put it in fun or back to school? Because they may need, it's the end of the school year. So they're going to have festivals, parties, stuff like that. So let's put this other five in there so now back to school has 10. Yay okay so we've gone ahead and figured that out that was a little bit stressful because they have needs and then wants and then you know how that goes how um, trying to figure it out keep it in, in check. Let's move on to my Christmas binder. One moment. All right so I pulled out my Christmas binder and we are going to unstuff Christmas and now it's empty. Christmas, we are stuffing 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. We are stuffing $55 into my Christmas binder and yes, I am very excited about it. <laughs> Oh man, hopefully I can get this, um, the plans that I have for Christmas underway. I mean, I, I'm excited for it. So let's go ahead and put $10 in for Victor, 5, 10, and now Victor has, sorry, this, um, it's not wanting to stay down. Let's see. I don't know how well that's going to help. I don't have a weight. 
One second. Sorry, I grabbed something that the closest thing I could find was post it notes. So Victor now has $15. Okay. All right, and then Vincent would go ahead and do the same. I'm gonna fill out the trackers after I'm finished here. Uh, I am bulk filming and I'm already exhausted from it. <laughs> All right, so Vincent, we've got five and 10. He has five in there, so now we have five, 10, 15. It's a flimsy five back there. All right, and then next up is Mommy, and so I will go ahead and give myself, uh, let's do, let's do two dollars. All right. And so uh, PTO is the time that I'm going to try to take off from work. Um, so then that way I can um, spend time with my kids. Last year uh, didn't work out all that well. Um, Christmas Day, of course, was fine. But the rest of Christmas break, not so much. So let's do, hmm, should we do 20? No, yes, we'll do 20. 20 in PTO, 5, 10, 15, 20. Um, in total now we have 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So however much I'm able to save in PTO will determine actually how many weeks I'll be able to take off. And then the obviously the PTO I save with my job. Um, I don't get very much because I am a part-time employee. So PTO is stuff. And then I think the rest of this we'll go ahead and put into our 25 days of Christmas which will be 5, 10, 11, 12, 13 more dollars. Yes. <laughs> so now uh, 25 days of Christmas has 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23 dollars. I have a long way to go. I mean, I have plenty of time, but my budget is uh, very, very tight. So I'm hoping that uh, at the very minimum, I'm able to get each of my kids a very nice gift, right? That's the plan for their each individual envelope. Get myself a little something, nothing wild or crazy. Um, and then uh, my main thing that I want to focus on is making sure that I'm taking time off versus a gift. So um, however much I save in there, getting some time off. And then my 25 days of Christmas is making sure that when uh, December 1st comes around, I am able to give my kids a gift from the 1st through the 25th, and then the big, you know, the big gifts under the tree on the 25th. So that's that. <laughs> you guys, I want to thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. All of the things that can keep us connected, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Feel free to check out SNC Budget Creations. We're on Etsy, and you can find us on Instagram. So that's it, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.